This is Math 142. This is the final practice. And we are supposed to find the, the x value here in this triangle, not drawn to scale. And uh, it says round to two decimal places. So we'll round it to two decimal places. So as I look at this, I notice I have uh, a side, the angle between it, and another side. So two sides and the angle between them. That screams out a uh, law of cosines. So I'll take this side x, x squared, and I'll treat it like it's Pythagorean theorem. So that should be 12 squared plus 7 squared, but this isn't a right angle, so I need this little fix. Uh, 2 times both of those sides. times the cosine of the angle between them. Clean that up a little bit. So I have this uh, 12 squared plus 7 squared minus 2 times 12 times 7 times the cosine of 53 degrees. And this whole thing here, I can just enter all that into my calculator just in one instance. I don't need to do it a piece at a time. Um, one mistake that I see people do is they'll figure that, and then they'll figure that, then they'll subtract it, and then they'll multiply by the cosine of 53. But remember, this is all one term. So it's these things added together minus all of these things multiplied together. But like I said, I can enter it just all into my calculator in one, in one entry. So let me do that. So it was uh, 12 squared plus 7 squared minus uh, 2 times 12 times 7 times the cosine of 53 degrees. Well, I better make sure I'm in degrees. I am. Great, and I get about 91.895. So this whole thing evaluates to Uh, I don't remember what it was, 91.8 something 5, blah, 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 blah. But notice that's not my answer. That's what x squared is. So I need to square root. I need to square root that to get my answer. So it's still my calculator. So let me uh, square root the answer. Square root the thing I just got. So my answer should be this, about 9.59. And there it is, rounded to two decimal places.